We can't get to Diddy his that. lawyer says Costco explains why feds found 1,000 baby oil bottles. People are buzzing about the massive quantity of baby oil found when the feds raided Diddy's homes in Beverly Hills and Miami, and his lawyer is offering up an explanation. Attorney Mark Agnafilo appears in a new TMZ Studios documentary, The Downfall of Diddy. The indictment, which is dropping soon on Tubi. Freak-offs are described as elaborate offs with multiple victims. However, um, and I'll be coming here. Hesitant to believe. Agnafilo has a different view of Diddy's freak-offs than the U.S. attorney. Agnafilo says there were typically threesomes with Diddy, Cassie, and another male. That raises the question, why would there be 1,000 bottles of baby oil for threesomes, as opposed to orgies? Check out the clip, Agnophilo makes the point, there are Costco stores near both of Diddy's homes, so... You know, we're, we're going through our defense. Sean Diddy Combs lawyer attempts to... The documentary chronicles the indictment, the defense and many issues that have not surfaced. Ordinarily, U.S. District Judge Gary J. Brown would have sent the man to the local federal jail to serve out his sentence for tax fraud. But one thing stopped him, the dangerous, barbaric conditions that have existed for some time at the Metropolitan Detention Center in Brooklyn. The notorious jail, commonly known as MDC, is in the spotlight once again due to its latest celebrity detainee. Diddy, the indictment, released September 25th. And do you are thinking of... Bail. of the products to begin with agnifilo claims of diddy last week a new york judge ordered sean diddy combs be held there after federal prosecutors charged him with sex trafficking racketeering and transportation to engage in prostitution he has pleaded not guilty high profile defendants like mr combs sometimes receive special protection when jailed and the music mogul is reported to be in a section of MDC Brooklyn for detainees who require special protection. In a place like this, but I can tell you, um, that's on Combs' alleged freak-offs, as well as the one that okay, listed right. for you. Okay, the how last you one. How do you explain? Mr. Combs is, according to local media reports, sharing a dormitory-style room there with the cryptocurrency entrepreneur Sam Bankman-Fried who once ran a company worth billions but was convicted on multiple counts of fraud in March. That's what we can inform you, if the audience is satisfied with the information, don't forget to help us by liking, commenting, sharing and subscribing. For the support of all the viewers, we thank you. He isn't really sure what the baby oil has to do. Firearms and ammunition, including three defaced... You know, we, we can't get so puritanical.